Actually, the Lakers are more dangerous this season than last year. Any team that faces the Lakers with any hint of un uh, underestimating the Lakers will definitely lose. So Kobe's injured now, which he's recovering from. He's, he he's, he's recovered. It's just that he needs to build up his endurance and all that. He needs to get, get everything in place. And you know what? If he's going to delay it one week for good, good assurance, so be it. So he's been in the NBA half his life. Do you think he's going to get a sixth ring? I believe he'll get his seventh ring, yes. And he's going to win the championship this year. Well, yeah. I mean, uh, we'll see. We'll see what happens. We, 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 how the ball bounces. We'll see how what happens about the championship for this season. The West is a bit of uh, spaghetti. We we don't know who's gonna get what and all that. How how these teams will gel together? Because they're all facing some challenges. Not just the Lakers. Actually, the Lakers. I have to say it again. They're better off than they were last year. A lot better off. The injuries are not there. Kobe's coming off the injury just in time. He, maybe the first week or sixth week of the league, he'll be into the game. And it's gotten more athletic, the team. So you're going to notice that when the, when the season starts. As far as championships, I'll talk about the East Coast. There are three scary teams in the East Coast. You have the Brooklyn Nets. They're very deep. Um, you have the Bulls with Derrick Rose return. They are scary. And then you have Indiana Pacers that almost knocked off Miami last year. And I believe Indiana Pacers are very likely to reach the finals. Coming back to Miami Heat, I don't think they're going to repeat. I don't think they're even going to get, they may get to the Eastern Conference, let alone the Western Finals. Oh, actually, he's still there. Next no, he's still there. They're all there. It's just that uh, the rest of the league have know how to handle them. They smell blood, and especially Indiana. They're more athletic, they, they, all the gaps are filled, and, and uh, maybe Miami are strong off the charts in every, uh, every side of the game, but they are one of the worst in rebounding, and that's not something that Indiana has. Miami does, has an issue with rebounding, but they're excellent in everything else, scoring, stealing, defense, but rebounding, they can't fix that. And it's hard to balance. You will not have an NBA team that has everything complete. So really, if I'm going to make a bet, I'm betting Miami will not win the championship. Maybe not even get to the finals.